new evidence-based South African emergency care guidelines will be implemented soon. But we as a profession need to acknowledge and address some challenges if these guidelines are to work in practice. Finding solutions to the challenges needs to start with a solid understanding of what the problem is. We thus conducted research across South Africa and asked paramedics what they expected to see from the guidelines to let us know what they expected to be particularly challenging in using them and importantly, to give us their ideas on how to best implement them. So what did we find? We received valuable input that will help decision makers disseminate and implement these new emergency care guidelines. Key solutions focused around communication, technology, autonomy and education. Highlighting the need for clear and consistent communication from stakeholders, the creation of inclusive career pathways and an end user document that helps with the transition process. We will act on these findings and our main message to you is that this guideline, based on the best available evidence, is now available for South Africa. Successful uptake will require an understanding of the contextual issues and the solutions of the end users of the guideline, the need for clear communication between stakeholders and a clear implementation plan that is contextually appropriate is recognized and will have to be developed in order to strengthen guideline uptake. In order to make sure that our findings is used by the right people, we involved decision makers at the start and throughout the project. These included people from the National Department of Health and support from the Professional Board of Emergency Care. We shared our findings with them and are now working together to inform conversations among decision makers around getting the evidence into policy and practice to achieve our ultimate goal of benefits to our patients. If you are interested in knowing more, follow us on Twitter, Facebook or email us.